bad morning to you. I mean, good morning, I guess. This is my second trip out to school today to pick up a throwing up child, a puke child. It's kind of like the spring break nightmare that every parent wants to avoid. You know, we've got Lindsay and Will and their four kids here. Um, Evie was kind of a sickie yesterday, now Lissy this morning, and now Andromeda this morning. So the grand adventure of them coming out here to Utah may just be us taking care of sick kids. Zofran. Look up Zofran. It's a life changer for all the children and hopefully stop this before it turns into the nightmare scenario. Sick update for you. Relax is now sick. Why does it have to happen on spring break? Now uh, somebody's got to stay home with the sick kids. Once the stomach bug starts in a house, it's highly contagious. And there's really no stopping it. So hopefully tomorrow things will clear up magically, miraculously. We can all spend time together as two families and kind of enjoy the outdoors or whatever adventures we have planned. But right now, it's kind of miserable. I'm here with Lindsay. Lindsay is Amy's sister. <laughs> Her spirit is resting with us today because she's super shy. But she's going to join us in a minute and answer five questions. What are the five questions? Well, we, we, we met Zach Henry, which is Amy's brother. Lindsay's Amy's other brother. <laughs> Lindsay is the other brother. She's a little different. And basically, what this comes from is a guy named Boaz. Boaz is a motivational speaker for Boaz Power TV. He's old, he's kind of strange, but he's changed my life. Now these five questions help you connect with people, and especially if you have severe social anxiety like myself, um, it gives you a little template on how to talk to your fellow humans. Now what I'm gonna ask Lindsay are these five questions. So Lindsay, you look a little different. Where are you, <laughs> Lindsay? <laughs> Lindsay, where are you from originally? My mama. <laughs> that was Amy talking because we don't see the, who's talking on the screen. Where are you from originally? Um, Hampton, Virginia. What brought you here? Uh, vacation. Vacation. Okay. Do you have a family? Yes. Can you elaborate a little bit on that? Um. I have lots of different types of family, <laughs> like children. Turtle family. So you have kids. I have kids, and then okay. I have brother and sister, parents, you know. Okay. Question four, what do you do? I do, I play guitar. This is I Lindsay's. Take, play guitar poorly. You play Very guitar. Very poorly. And I take care of my kids. That's about it. The final question, and this is what got Zach all worked up. What did you want to be when you were growing up? A pediatrician. Why did you want to be a pediatrician? Um, well, that was a pediatrician or a teacher. What is a pediatrician? Uh, children's, children's doctor. <laughs> what is that? Oh, it's a kid doctor. It's a um, doctor I know specialist. I wanted to work with kids. Okay. And. I wanted to like help people, but then I found out that it would be eight years of school. So and, it's, and, it was, that, it was too and I hard. also knew I wanted to have a family, okay. and I knew that I probably couldn't be a pediatrician the way I wanted to be a pediatrician, and also be a parent the way I wanted to be a parent. Okay, so you thought it would interfere with your family? They would each interview with each other. Okay. Can't do it all. 
So you, the path you chose was family life rather than pediatrician. Do you ever think you'll try it again after the babies are No. Out? If I, I do think I'll do something helping people, if it, like career-wise maybe, I don't know. Versus hurting people. I don't know what I would like to do if I had a job job. Maybe something philanthropic. That's a big That's word. That's philanthropic. <laughs> no. <laughs> no, it's philanthropic. Well, th Lindsay, thank, uh, thank you for answering these five questions. I think I've gotten to know you better. Thank you. Um, I didn't realize the struggle you had to choose the paths between pediatrician and family life, but a lot of us deal with that. Um, anything else you'd like to add? Uh, are you enjoying Alabama? It's okay. It's okay. Well, thank you very much. Um, I hope to talk to your husband, Will, tomorrow. And he has time to think about his answers.